Hey guys, welcome to Yardy Belly TV. This is the wifey and today I'm going to be showing you how I make my world famous fried bammies. Yes. So today I'm using these bammies from the JCS brand. It's two large bammies that I am pretty much going to go ahead and cut into smaller, more shareable sizes. So I'm cutting it initially into half and then each half I will go ahead and cut into an additional three pieces. So in And I'm just using a clear wrap to cover the bowl just to keep it you know nice and secure as it sits and wait for that moment of truth all right you guys so the bammies have been soaking for quite a while <laughs> let me just say maybe closer to an hour even so what I'm doing is I'm just draining them off so that we can move on to frying them 
So I just use this hand towel, paper towel, to just pat dry them and pretty much you're good to go. After that, you just put them in your oil to fry and that's it. And soaking them in the the milk or the yeah the coconut milk um, liquid actually makes the thing softer the bami it makes the bami much softer and what else be tea what else all right okay. Yeah guys, so the whole purpose of soaking the bami in the milk is to make the bami softer after it's fried and it also infuse a whole lot of flavor into the bami's you guys. So you can't you don't skip this step. Don't just attempt to fry your bami by just taking it out of the package and throwing it in the oil. No. No 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 no. So yeah, we're on to frying. Alright, so in a pot, um, um, a Dutch pot, we have the oil being heated and I'm just going to test if the oil is hot enough. Mm. I think it could be a little bit hotter, but yeah, let's go ahead. Yeah, it needs to be a little bit hotter. After about three minutes or so, I'm flipping them over so that the other side can get golden brown. And the fire is on low heat. I don't know if I mentioned that before, but that's important because these things will just totally burn up immediately after putting them in the pot if the oil is too hot. So you have to make sure that the pot is on a moderate level. Come on. So nice and golden brown those are that's what you're going for Yeah, so after another two minutes on the other side, I'm getting ready to take them out. Put them on my paper towel to drain. Oops. You have to drain them on your paper towel, you guys, because bamis tend to absorb the oil. So you want to ensure that the excess oil is um, removed with the paper towel. All right, all right, all right. Pot done fry and the bummies are all set and ready to be devoured. Look how nice and golden brown these look, you guys. These are, um, I cannot wait to sink my teeth down into one of these. This is an all time favorite um, food item from Jamaica. And yeah, this is the outcome remember guys you can try it in your neck of the woods if it's available and um, thank you guys for watching as usual remember to like rate subscribe and tell a friend about yardy belly TV also remember to share the video and as usual remember to live and laugh cook and eat 
Yadabelle TV, c'est ça. Bless up.